y'all want to see how I got these bombshell curls continue to watch I just wanted to show y'all how detailed it is and I even slowed it down in slow motion further along the video but it's really not hard and I feel like you could do this at home and I just want to give y'all the tools to just know how to do y'all's hair yourselves and stop depending on others. I also did the silk press before the curls and I'll link that. Hey y'all, it's me Tiana Chanel and I'm back with a hair video. I straightened my hair and I just wanted to teach y'all not only how to style y'all hair but actually how to do it. Because one thing I realized that made my hair grow a lot is not going to the hair salon and not depend on other people to know how to do my hair. Because once I started doing my hair myself and I started detangling from the ends and being gentle with my hair, you'll pay attention when you go back to these salons, how careless they are with your hair when it comes to detangling, brushing, styling, all that. And all that roughness is the majority of the cause of why your hair is breaking off and not retaining length because your hair is always growing. So you wanna be like, how to grow your hair, how to do this, how to do that. Your hair is always growing. It's more about retaining length. And a lot of hair salons don't foster these type of nourishment for your hair to retain length. So that's why you're always in your hair trim. That's why it's never growing, no matter what you're doing at home. Because when you go there, they fucking it up, basically. So, I straighten my hair. And I have two videos on how I straighten my hair. I could do an updated one because my hair is longer. But the whole process is the same. And the only difference between like doing your hair at home, like a silk press at home versus in a salon is the products. But if you know how to, you know, if you know how to use the same techniques just in a better way that's healthy for your hair, you can get close, very, very close to that. So y'all see my hair is flowy. I straightened my hair like three days ago. I'll show you what it looked like when I first straightened it. Straightened it. But a link, both the links will be down below to how I straighten my hair. I'm about to curl it as y'all can see from the thumbnail. Sorry for all the talking, I just had to get that out. But um, yeah, to get a silk press at home, you just need to use good products, a good clarifying shampoo or something that does similar to that. And I use my Shea Moisture. Um, this is my for this silk press, this is all I use. I know natural hair girlies, y'all be wanting to, let me not say y'all, cause I didn't want to. We be wanting to leave the product in the hair. When you do a silk press, you have to thoroughly, thoroughly, thoroughly rinse everything out. Mind you, when you shampoo, you don't need a shampoo that's gonna make your hair feel hydrated and all coated and all that because you want your hair to flow when it's straight. You don't need all that. So use a clarifying shampoo that's just gonna dry your hair out. That sounds stupid, but basically, use a good conditioner, a rinse out conditioner, not leave in, and um, leave that on your hair. I left mine on for like an hour. Wait, I'm saying it backwards. This is shampoo, this conditioner. I left the conditioner on my hair, drenched my hair with it, left it on for like an hour, rinse every single bit of it out. It's the rinsing out part, y'all, for real. When I blow dried it, I used the tension method and I started at my roots. I might just have to do a video on that. But for now, that's the video to the, um, how I did my soap press. So now I'm gonna show y'all how I curl it. And I guess I'm gonna do my edges cause y'all always like see me do my edges, even though it takes so much time. It's not gonna be fully detailed because like I said, I got 30 of those also that I can link down below if y'all want. But yeah, let's get started. I use my yeah, I have an Amazon storefront. I keep on forgetting I have it, but I do it down below when I do my hair videos. Most of the stuff I use is going to be in my Amazon storefront. Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you say. You said that you would come again. You said that we would remain friends, but you know that I do not depend on nothing or no one. So why would you show up so uninvited then just change my mind like that? Please don't take this personal, but you ain't shit. You ain't special till I made you so. You better act like you know that I've been the worst to you. It's pretty long, just in a bucket. Yeah, it's pretty long, just in a bucket.
So this is my edges. So let's get into the real part, cause this is how to grow your hair at home. Big, cute, bombshell, curls, what else is that? I am, cause I realize a lot of people don't know how to curl their hair. I'm gonna curl my hair on 375 degrees. You really shouldn't go over 350. Maybe I should do this. And no, I'm gonna do 375. Mind you, I'm using this heat protectant that I've already sprayed in my hair, the Chia heat protectant. And I'll probably use some of this Silk Therapy Bio Silk Hair Serum. I don't even think this is mine. It might be. So let me show y'all my hair before we even start. So y'all can see the one. My friend just recently trimmed it. The ends is a little like bump. Not right because um I just had my scarf on before I put in the ponytail. So I'm about to part of my hair. I think I'm gonna end up wanting to do a side part, but just for the sake of part in the hair and stuff. I'm gonna do a This is the hair. Maybe it's not good that I wear a black shirt. So, I like to do like not too little protection. I already put the heat protecting on. And this is the first piece. You wanna go under? Very cute. I'm not putting hairspray in my hair because when you put hairspray and stuff like that in your hair, the hairstyles or the straight don't last long because you have a whole bunch of product in your hair. And when I straighten my hair, y'all, yeah, I don't be straightening it for no reason. I'll leave it straight for like a month. Focus on me. Can you focus on me? 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 Can you focus on
Okay, now that's it for this section. So I'm gonna do the other part off camera. So it's like this. At the bottom, I just twisted it together. So like the one drop while I do the top. I'm at the top now. And um, I'll be dropping or uploading this video on Friday. So by next Tuesday, it will definitely be a hairstyle tutorial along with it. I was gonna really just do how to curl, style your hair with curls, but I don't wanna tell you how to style it here without actually telling you how to get the curls. If that makes sense. It's very cute. I wore my hair like this before, like a thousand times. Okay. Now I'm gonna do the other side off camera and get back to y'all. Very. Let me write my hands. But I did my makeup, my eyelashes are already done, so yeah, but very cute, y'all. Yeah.